Throwback Thursdays. Blah, 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 blah. No, I'm joking. It's your boy Posted Gleam, aka Channel One Mind, and I'm here bringing you some Tekken Tag Tournament Two, baby. Yes, yes, yes. We are playing Tekken Tag Tournament Two, and uh, well, let me rephrase that. Um, let me let let me explain everything. All right. So me, Astro, another good brother who we play Tekken with, play Tekken Seven with, JLR Chai. Um, he he basically uh, they basically were playing Tekken Tag Tournament Two, and they have a deal right now on the PS uh, Now, on the PlayStation Now, where you can stream Tekken. You can stream Tekken Tag Tournament Two on your PS4. You know they can't be like Xbox where you get to get the game for you know you can if you have the game already you can just put it in your system and download it and play it. No, they gotta be. You know that's funny. Before I get into this match, I know we went right into this match, but it's gonna be a lot of fight, a lot of fights here. But so let me get this straight. And uh, I don't know if y'all remember this, but in E3 years ago, they got a lot of crap. Microsoft about sharing games and being able to play old games and things like that and PlayStation was like oh yeah but we're not gonna do that we're gonna have it where but then it turns out PlayStation they're the ones don't even support backwards compatibility you have to go to a PlayStation now and subscribe to a service where they have backwards compatibility whereas an Xbox you literally can just put the game in a system let it download and you can play the game on this Xbox be winning out here and y'all guys don't be giving them the credit they deserve. But I digress. Um, so yeah, this is a bunch of matches that me, Astro, and uh, JLR had. Because what happened was, we were sitting around playing Tekken 7. And then all of a sudden they tell me, they were playing Tekken Tag. They got the free 7 month trial. And so I'm just like, hey, I want to get in on this Tekken Tag tournament too. It's been a while since I played that game. So of course, this is not like... Like it live, it's streaming. So I mean, it's kind of hard to to put it into words. Like you think you're, you're seeing a game like it's fluent. Like no, streaming wise, this shit is terrible. <laughs> streaming a game is not a great way to play a fighting game that requires precision and timing. But uh, but no, we're having fun. We was having a lot of fun playing this game, and this is actually really current because uh, oh, look at that trip. He was actually like, and then the, the thing is, we're trying to bring Tekken. Of course, you see, I got my boy Nightmare Impact back. And again, this is me uh, at like learning the character all over again, pretty much Nightmare Impact, because he's because he's completely. It's not that he's different. It's just it's hard to juggle on a, a game when you have no connection. And then you see me trying to come do the moves I did with Fang. Oh. And Fang can play so different in this game compared to Tekken 7. Oh, oh, bang. But some things are the same. <laughs> Stop ducking. And because Astro got his new team also. As you can see, I don't have a juggle for that move. Oh, no. Not like this. Not like this. And of course, his stupid robot's still the same. close one here. I gotta try to whittle her down without taking damage here. Ugh. I feel like he got shorter arms now. Oh my god. And so Astro gets that game. Him and his uh, his cheesy team. But of course, uh, we're gonna there's gonna be many matches because like I, I only can record the matches I were in. I couldn't record the matches that I wasn't in, so that's why you'll see like matches where it's like um, JL will be because sometimes one person will win and then it'll be them. So these are not in order. These are not in any order, by the way. Uh, I gotta say that streaming te Tekken Tag does hold up better than I remember, in the sense of the game still is like. It still is a competent game, like it's still good. The only problem I'm having is the streaming process. Like, cause you gotta remember, we're streaming to game to play online. So, it's not like it's like, uh, it's a little delay in everything you do. 
it's like think of it as a like instead of being even for five bar connection treat it like it's a two bar connection <laughs> so it's a little awkward but I think it's one of the things you'll get used to the more and more you play the game oh god as you can see this is me still trying to figure out my buttons here like to get back into playing with Bruce cause it's been so long. I mean, I haven't had the, I really haven't had the chance to really play with the character. Uh, uh. Here we go. That's a combo. There we go. That's a tag combo. And Paul plays a little different too. Like, there's only really the three moves that are different. Paul is pretty much the same. He's only like they only changed his low. Uh, his 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 low one plus two grab uh an underhook. Which you're never gonna see me even use. Oof. Getting demolished here. It'd be nice to still have your stupid robot. Uh. And of course I messed that up. Drop the combo. <laughs> Cause I didn't know, uh, again, it's like I told you, it's one of those things where it'll come back to you the longer you play. The longer you play, the more it's gonna definitely have to come back. Cause... Oh, nice. Nice, roll backwards. See, that's what that's what's missing in Tekken 7. Being able to juggle a person rolling backwards. Uh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Nope, missed it. Let's go, Paul. Let's go, Paul. Put him where at work, Paul. I don't know where he was hitting at. Oh, God. Astro and his one button mapping, one button grabs. Get out of here. Stop it all that grabbing. Fight. Don't call it a comeback. Uh. Bang. Here we go. Dropped it. <laughs> and none of us are professionals here when it comes to tech attack. So if you wonder why it's like why it's like it's like, oh my god, they like they're not they're missing all these juggles and as you can see by the name, it says beginners. We are beginners. Cause we don't know how to tag with these characters or nothing. Yeah, that don't change. Eat them death fists. No, not like this. With the cheesiness of the grab, that's Astro winning two in a row. I remember he was so excited when they actually clap half high five. He was just like, "Oh my god, they clap high five. <laughs> and now you get to see me versus Jeff. And again, I can only put up my matches that I'm in. I can't put in other people's matches. So that's why you're wondering why you only see my matches. Well, hey, it doesn't have the ability to record the whole stream. I mean, I I don't want it to have that ability because think about it. You're streaming. And then you start recording the stream while you're streaming, while you're playing a game with other uh, online. No, I don't, I, I don't think we're yet. We haven't reached that 5G level. <laughs> but don't, but don't tell Donald Trump because he think we, you know, he think that we fake it till you make it, which he's used to doing. You know, you get, you'll get there. We'll get to the 5G. I see Jails rocking the wing. Another more characters that are not in Tekken Seven. See, you know what's funny? He's one of the people who actually, his characters, his main got nerfed too, because his main is not in this game, which is he played Bad is his main, and so you'll get to see him later on with his Bad, and Zafina is one of his other characters that he he mained a lot of. Oh, look at Zafina! When did she stop attacking? No. Get off me. Get off me. Get down. Get him. Get him. Get him. Try to get him off me. <laughs> but no, the difference between Fang and this game is one of his main things that I use to juggle, his his um, forward one plus two, is a shoulder tackle on this. So it's a little weird because, like, you can't, you can't do one plus two to, you know, to extend the juggle. With Fang, and 
The thing about Wang in this game, I forgot is his distance is really weird. Like he can hit you from a further distance than I remember. And again, I don't know when her combos begin and end, so it's like, <laughs> it's like she's on the ground. I can't hit her low. Again, you gotta predict when she's gonna stop her combos too. And JL is over here cheesing with his his character. He's like, I got my character back. I got my character back. <laughs> Cause he's a big Zafina fan. Maybe she'll be in season three of Tekken Seven. I doubt it, but I'm holding out hope that a lot of characters. You know, honestly, I don't want a lot of characters back. I mean, I'll be happy if they, they go, hey, we're bringing every character back. I'd be fine with that. I really would. I'd be fine with that. I, I don't have a problem with that. I just think that, like, you don't need to release no more characters in DLC. I think game modes is what's needed in Tekken right now. Tekken 7. To make keep people from going stale. It's not the characters. It's the game modes. I think you can still save the characters for, like, Season 4. I think this game's popular enough to have a Season 4. I mean, why not? If, if what, what what season is uh Mortal Kombat? Mortal Kombat got to like what ten seasons or some shit. So, and I think Tekken is ten times better than that game. So, Mortal Kombat 11. No, 10. What was it? 10. I don't remember. I had that Mortal Kombat XL for a minute, so I never really touched it. Drop that combo. Yeah, I remember that up knee used to terrorize uh, Zafina's actually. I just, I just don't remember how to play her. That's the thing. When you learn how to defend against her, uh, you know, it would be really useful. In Tekken, in the original Tekken Tag Tournament 2, I knew how to defend against her. But I have no idea now because I don't remember her. There we go. Had to keep switching his up knee and get, get them knees, get the hell out of here. <laughs> and definitely let me know if you actually really like this Tekken, uh, this Tekken footage I'm throwing up. This, of, of us playing Tekken Tag Tournament 2. Us retrying to learn how to play Tekken Tag Tournament 2, if you can see by all our, because all our ranks are exactly accurate because we didn't have... You know, I came from the Xbox 360 version, so did Astro, and JL, I believe, he came from PlayStation version, but you, when you download this game from the PlayStation Now, you have to, like, you know, it's, you know, it has all your information that's saved, and so, uh, we have yet to even play the game, really, so it's like, and I doubt I'll be even going online and practice, I'm, I don't think I'm gonna even do that with this game, it's pointless. Yeah, putting the pressure on Astro. And now here's one that I have to... Oh my god, I have to remember how to play against, even in Tekken. <laughs> like, I'm trying to shoulder tackle her. Which is funny because shoulder tackles actually work in Tekken uh, 7 against that move. The smooth side step. Yeah, what are you doing? And I got no combo to juggle that now. See, everything's all good until that stupid character come out. Oh. Side step. Yep. <laughs> Only Ling. Only Ling. Nope. You will not be. Oh, with the grabbing. You're going to see that a lot. Prepare to see that a lot. Yep. Trash. <laughs> no, not like this. Oh God, he gets snuck that victory because I didn't tag out. And again, I I can't emphasize how much, how how hard it is to play Fang when uh, and you don't know how to juggle. <laughs> but he is really beast in this game. Like, just in a fighting tip, he is a beast. 
Yep. Hit that mid. I do remember that being effective against her her role. I do remember that now, that mid. That back one, that back two. Whenever she turns her back and go try to go to that ducking stance. It just grabbed me out of shifting clouds. Yo, uh, you want to tag team you grab, huh? And this is why I, I actually remember this. I made the fatal mistake of trying to do what Astro was doing. See, the difference is he has his setup to one button grab. So he can one button press, you know. You know how I feel about mapping buttons. And I accidentally did it right there. I tried to grab with the... Because to do that grab, you have to tag, hold the Y button, and press tag. And if you do it too early, then you'll tag instead of actually grabbing. And so I made the mistake of, you know, of not buffering the grab, the, 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 the two punch with the grab. And so, you know, it happens. See, that, ha that kind of stuff happens when you don't map buttons because map buttons is cheating. And I will always say it's cheating. I don't care what professional player plays it. If I had a tournament, which you never know might happen in the future, best believe map buttons will not be allowed unless you're fighting on a fight stick. If you're not fighting on a fight stick, you will not be allowed to map buttons. And the only reason I allow you to do it on a fight stick is because a, map, a fight stick needs to be tailored to how, whatever, depending on the game. So if you're playing a Street Fighter, you don't need certain buttons. You can make it move them closer. I understand that. But if you're playing on a, on a, a regular controller, nah, forget that, son. You have no excuse. And here we go. Now I'm starting to get into rhythm, and of course I drop it right when I say that. All that work, and I only did a little bit of damage, to be fair. Oh, I gotta learn to stomp. I, I, I don't know why I didn't use the big stomp as much. Oh. Oh, get out of here. It's just stupid. Kick that knee. That's actually one of his most damaging uh, combos. Dang. Look at that. Putting it together now. Starting to get in the rhythm. And then Astro Shot comes with the trip that's unseeable online. <laughs> and then I gotta remember. I can, I don't remember half of the Paul. Uh, I don't. I so don't use the character anymore that I've forgotten pretty much how to even play him. And so here I'm still trying to work out my buttons and figure out. Like, cause I, there's a difference when you know how to, when you're comfortable with a character, and then when, you know, when you're just trying to fight with them. So it's like, it's hard to explain. If, there's times where you can be like, you can be really good with a character, but you don't know how to fight with them. Meaning, you don't know what moves to use to just, to eke out just different things that a person might do. And, and so I'm trying to figure that out again with, with Bruce. Oh, no. The trip is still so heavy. The trip is so strong. No, get out of here with that. Man, look how much damage that did. That was that counter hit, man. Paul is a definition of. A, I never noticed it, but even Tekken Tag Tournament Two, he was a powerhouse, man. Can't let you. And so what I should do here is do the, the two grab. Cause it'll kill that red health, so she can't heal. I remember now. I'm remembering things. I'm even while I'm watching, I'm remembering red health and how important it is to kill red health. So that person can't heal. And again, he killed my just killed my red health. I don't know. I don't know how that happened. What move that? Why that person was able to kill the red health of Bruce in the background? If he was paying attention. Don't be backing up in here. Don't be showing no movement. Oh, nice. I noticed that Astro Shop doesn't exactly do uh, the same fighting style that. Oh, God, just dropped that combo. And I, I kept reading that, that low wrong. I noticed that, that that low was just hitting me constantly. 
Stop doing that. <laughs> nice. That was a nice punish. So final round here. Tackle to the shoulder breaker. The arm bar. Man. Just bring back memories of Lily just being so annoying. <laughs> uh, turning your back in the middle of a fight. What is wrong with you? I do notice that that um, Matterhorn doesn't hit as much as uh, it, use, it does in Tekken 7. That panic move. No, oh, Red Health Killer. Good duck. Nope. I don't know why I'm not using Ford Ford Four. Oh, there we go. One good juggle. <laughs> yeah. Ah, the bros. And so. Now nah, I get a match of him. And as you can see, like I said, it's just loser win takes, you know, goes to the next. So loser gives it up and move to the next. And this is all online, by the way. This wasn't like, hey, we was all hanging out in the same house. And so he's using his main. Now y'all get that chance to see him play his main character back. <laughs> the character who I hate. I hate. And I hate him because of his, uh, his, I feel like he's more elusive and tricky than, uh, a lot of the other, than that harangue is. He doesn't have the, the you know, the same makeup as harangue. Harangue is a lot quicker. Harangue goes into different stances. Like, but, and Beck pretty much is, like, doesn't work that way. But I just feel like his moves are so good. Ugh. Too bad he dies. Or oh, I assume he's dead. His ending in Tekken 6 seemed like it. Though we all know it's probably not canon. Sergei Dragonoff. I wonder, um, so Dragonoff, I wonder how different he is in Tekken 6 than he is in Tekken 7. I honestly don't know. I didn't even think to ask JL, like, what the differences are. Because he plays with a lot of characters that didn't make Tekken 7. So it's like it's hard to know. And he knows that I, I struggle against that bit because I don't look at him. See, I just I got him in the air and didn't know what combo to do off it. And that's one of those things that's going to come back to me as more and more I play. Oh, nice trip. This man tagging out. Tagging out on the pop-ups. JL been secretly been playing Tekken Tag without telling us. Ooh. The pressure of dragging off is real. Mid jab. Mid jab. Mid jab. Down one. Down one. Down one. <laughs> down forward one, I should say. Look at the carry. And it's, and it's really hard to, 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 to put it into words. Like, it's bad enough you're already playing a delay in everything you do. Now you gotta play against a a, a bad a bad player who's actually knows what they're doing. Who's not bad. He's really good, and he actually knows combos. And you're sitting here like, I don't know all my combos anymore. <laughs> uh, yeah, combo baby. Oof. Dragging off with the stomp, dragging off with the running too. Running two is a big difference in this game too, I can see. Cause he, he's not utilizing it as much as he probably should. Yeah. 
Oh, close enough. Get that grab. Oh, why did I get cute? No, not like this. That was a squash match. And so, as you can see, this is just going to keep going and keep going. Where we just, again, the fun of it was just playing different, just remembering all the times. Like, let me tell some stories. Let me tell you a little story, people. Sorry about that. I had to, to silence my phone because everyone wants to call me and message me at the same time. So, so hopefully we be having no more interruptions from, need I say, no wishers and ruffians. Anyway, back to what I was saying. So, Astro Shive, I actually got Astro Shive into playing Tekken in Tekken 6. Um, I might have said this before. And you might not, I don't know. Just, I'm assuming this is your first time watching it, me do a match. And if it is, go watch some of my other videos. Like and subscribe. But anyway, um, I got Astro into playing Tekken and Tekken 6. And needless to say, we played this game for like four years straight every night. Every night we had to at least play Tekken. There's two games we played the hell out of. And on a, on original, on original, it's Tekken 6 and it was original Gears of War. Gears of War 2, I mean. I mean... If you if you sum if I told you to sum up Xbox 360, it'd be those two games. Anyway, even though I know PlayStation, you know, it's really the home place of Tekken, but that's not the point. Anyway, uh, he really did not take to Tekken Tag, so he really stopped playing Tekken Tag at one point, and so pretty much I was the only one playing Tekken Tag. I mean, he'll play it once in a while, but he he treats Tekken he treated Tekken Tag like I treat Tekken Seven. Where I play it now once in a while. I, but the funny thing is, the Tekken Seven is you know, Astro is a diehard Tekken Seven fan. <laughs> like he loves that game, and so it's just so funny now to see us playing a game like Tekken Six because I mean Tekken Tag because when Tekken Seven came out, I didn't want to play Tekken Tag Tekken Seven. I'm confusing my words. Hold on, let me rephrase. Let me re say it. When Tekken Seven came out. I did not want to play Tekken uh, 7. I wanted to play Tekken Tag still because my character was still in the game. My character didn't make Tekken 7. And it probably won't make Tekken 7. So I was just like, and so he was always be like, oh, you're living in the past. You're living in the past. But ha ha, three years later, look who, look who, who was right. Look what game we're playing. All of a sudden now, Astro loves Tekken Tag Tournament 2. <laughs> But no, I just thought that was funny and like a weird like story. As you can see, we're playing. Uh, he's using Mah Maharu, Maharu, I believe that's her name. Which I still don't know what game she came in. I think she was a Tekken Four. Maharu. Um, she wasn't a replacement for Link. She was just another character that uh, you know had Link in it. And again, you see us doing. You see me doing the tag grab because. I got so sick of him doing tag grabs. I'm like, you want to tag grab all day? I'll show you how to tag grab. And I didn't even do the right one. I did the lazy tag grab. Because that's the lazy tag grab that he that we're both doing. The real one is the character specific tag grabs. Which I just remembered how to do it. And so as you can see, I just took that match easily with Kazuya and Bruce. <laughs> Live.